You know who it is. It's your man, Felonia Smunk, live and direct, coming at you with some real shit. Yo, speaking of which, I just got a question to ask you. What is gay? Oh, 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 my mother's got nervous now. When I say that word, it's a lot of different responses gonna come out from that. You now, I mean, you have some people, it's the destruction of the very fabric of the United States of America. Really? Let me ask you a question. If 50% of all marriages in the United States and in divorce, is that because somebody else is gay? Fuck out of Dodge. Do you even know where Dodge is? If you find out where Dodge is, GPS your way out. You, are you serious right now? You got gay people in every facet of life. In the military, in the government, gay men, openly gay men, get voted into United States Congress. They're good enough for that. Not good enough to get married though. Come on, B. I got a lot of jokes that I like to use that have gay themes. Do you know why? Because the shit's funny. Just like I have black jokes, I have Spanish jokes, I have white jokes. The shit's funny. I like to use my jokes. I can't even use my jokes now because this is a group that's so marginalized that rightfully they feel like, eh, you're just piling on. And it does feel like I'm piling on. I'm going to tell you how bad it is. I'm going to tell you how bad it is. I had two videos, one called No Homo, one called Pretty Boy Swag, that I actually removed briefly from my YouTube page. You know why? Because I use the F word. No, not fuck. You know I use that all the time. I use commas like that. You know, I'm like, word, 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 comma. Now nah, I'm not going to use the comma. I'm just going to say fuck. That's how I talk. But if it's you, you already know what to do. X, X. Do whatever you got to do. But I pulled them down. Not because I thought that they were slandering gay people, but because I knew that gay people would be offended. And not because they're ultra sensitive, but because they're at a point in their history where they're not accepted publicly. You remember this before if you were black, which is funny because a lot of black people are more homophobic than anyone else. You ever notice that in hip hop, nobody's allowed to be gay? Which again, real funny, because one of the greatest rappers of all time said the chick was so bad he sucked on his daddy's dick. Yeah, B.I.G. Shout out to Brooklyn. But look, what I'm saying to you was, obviously, Big wasn't gay. And even if he was, nobody cared. He was a dope lyricist. It didn't matter. Now, though, now you got rappers that are scared to say anything or dress anyway because somebody's going to call them gay. So what the fuck if they are, B? You can't legislate morality. You can't legislate people's personal choices. It doesn't matter. Here's what's funny about it. It's not illegal for interracial couples to get married. It's not illegal at all. Used to be. It's not now. Although, there's still some people who disagree with it. Why? Because it goes against their religious beliefs. It goes against their personal beliefs. It's your personal belief. You can't legislate that. Why are we trying to legislate gay marriage? Oh, here's the other thing. People even scared to speak out to defend gay people. It's kind of fucked up because gay people are walking around now trying to fight for their rights to do things legally as citizens, but nobody wants to defend them. You know why? Because they're scared they're being called gay. Somebody's going to look at this video and go, he's doing a whole lot of defending. He must be gay himself. I bet you the same people saying that would not invite me to their house with their girlfriend there and then go to the store to pick something up. You come back, I bet you should tell you the story. But what I'm telling you is, it doesn't matter if they're gay. That's their business. No gay people are knocking on your door and kicking in your door and saying, I'm coming in your house right now to destroy the fabric of your marriage. You know why? Because they don't give a fuck about what you're doing in your house. They want you to not give a fuck about what they're doing in their house. We got like eight rights left that Congress hasn't fucked over us about, and you're trying to take their right to do one more thing. Cut it out, B. Cut it out. It's gay people everywhere. Get used to it. See, here's the real issue. You're not trying to legislate gay marriage. You're not trying to legislate gay rights. You're trying to legislate gay. You hope that if we make enough laws that prevent them from doing certain things, they'll stop being gay. Good luck with that. Stop it, bitch. It's just corny, man. Fuck.